So the opioid crisis was declared a public health emergency in 2017. So why is now the time for a show like this? And that's something all of you could speak to. The, a lot of the show takes place in the early 2000s and we see this growing, but this is still very large, very urgent public health crisis right now. Uh, last year, 2020, saw the highest number of overdose deaths on record with 93,000 people dying. So it's certainly just as much of an issue now as it was then, if not more. And some of that has to do with the pandemic, but some people are saying, you know, public health experts I've spoken to that the deaths were going up in early 2020 before COVID hit as well. Um, so we can't say, you know, this was a blip. This is something that's continuing to be a problem. And some of the differences from, you know, maybe what we might see in the show in the early ages of the epidemic is that now a lot of the overdose deaths are coming from synthetic opioids like fentanyl, as opposed to prescription opioids, that sort of transition. And we're also seeing it affecting all the states and a lot more people. It's kind of maybe started off in these select communities, but it has spread out. And we're seeing racial impacts too with uh, black Americans seeing one of the fastest uh, growing rates of overdose deaths. So it's just impacting more and more people.